If you have ever found one of these rare coins, you are in for a huge payday. These are some of the rarest mint error coins that have sold at auction. So let's just hop right into it. Now, what if I told you a 1993 penny that looks like this on the front of the coin sold for $51? thousand dollars actually just a little over fifty one thousand you would probably be like whoever bought that coin is insane right well if you flip the coin over you'll see something is not right this is actually the reverse of a roosevelt dime so it is a genuine mint error coin here we have a 1993 lincoln cent that was struck with a dime reverse so that is a huge huge mint error and this coin is actually graded and authenticated by PCGS at a mint state 65 red that is why this coin sold for over $51,000 so a super super rare error there that's why you always check both sides of your coins now this next coin is a 1995 what is supposed to be a 1995 Roosevelt dime but again we have a Lincoln scent design on the obverse and it is muled here with a Roosevelt dime reverse. So this is a very awesome mint error as well, graded by NGC at a mint state 64. This error coin sold for a little over $57,000 at auction. Can you believe that? $57,000. And let me tell you, that coin sold in 2010, and actually the both of the first coins that we looked at sold in 2010. This next coin that we're looking at here sold in 2006. It's a 1999 penny that you would not really think much of here on the obverse of the coin if you were like going through your change, you know, but this coin sold for $138,000. That's right, a six figure coin here. And again, it's very, very similar to that first coin we looked at, the 1993, but this is the 1999 where we have that Roosevelt dime reverse here with the Lincoln Cent obverse, so it's muled. Again, that is an extremely rare error to take place. And this coin graded by PCGS at a mint state 66 ended up selling for again, $138,000. Next up is uh, another coin. You know, you can actually go to the bank and get rolls of, you know, $1 coins, you know, the gold dollars, presidential dollars, Sacagawea dollars. And you know, they're very common coins, but you can look for errors on them. This is the rarest error on those coins that you could possibly find. It, is a dollar coin uh, reverse here and this coin sold for over $88,000 at auction because if we flip the coin over you'll see that it's muled with a 25 cent obverse design. Uh, so that is the state quarter obverse design and again this coin is graded by PCGS at a mint state 66 and the coin again sold for over 88 grand. So huge, huge mint error there. All right guys, if you want a coin mat, they are available right now on couchcollectibles.com. We have the nickel mat, penny mat, quarter mat, and half dollar coin mat. A lot of dates updated and added, RPMs, all the way up until 2023 here on the penny mats. Super soft for your coins, nice and rubber, light, easy to you know fold up, carry wherever you want. And then bam, you wanna go through your coins, you get you a roll of coins break it out on there save the ones you want key dates or any errors that you find or any silver you can actually get these right now on couchcollectibles.com hit the link in the comments below if you guys want to pick up all four you can get all four for a deal that are a lot cheaper than buying them individually so feel free to pick one up in the comments below couchcollectibles.com and let's move on here to a very similar one this is the year 2000 as well the coin sold for $66,000 at auction and it actually sold in the year 2022. Now, the last coin I forgot to say sold in 2013, but this coin here sold in 2022, just a year ago, if you're watching this video in 2023. And this coin, as we flip it over, has a South Carolina state quarter reverse with the Sacagawea obverse design. So again, a muled coin here, 
graded by PCGS at a Mint State 64, $66,000. And we also have a 2001 Lincoln Cent design here on the obverse of this coin. Looks like any old 2001 penny would, right? But again, as we flip the coin over, you'll see that Roosevelt dime reverse. So this is taking place on three different years. We've seen 1993, 1999, 2001. We got a muled coin here, graded by PCGS at a Mint State 66 red. This is a six figure coin, guys. This coin sold for $115,000. Unbelievable. And then we also have a no dated Washington quarter. This coin here sold in 2006 for over $41,000. So again, Always check both sides of your coins because we see that it looks very normal on one side, but as we flip the coin over, we actually see the reverse design again. And that's because it was struck with two reverse dies. And it's been double struck as well and has an indent. So uh, it's got a lot going on here, over a $41,000 coin. I can't stress enough how important it is to check both sides of your coins. And feel free to check out the rest of the videos here on the channel, we're showing you my modern coins and older coins that are worth a lot of money. And don't forget to subscribe in the middle. Feel free to check out those videos to the left of me. And until tomorrow, I'll see you guys in the comment section below. This is Couch Collectibles and this is where I disappear.